Hi, Mike Studer here. We're going to try to see if we can uh, demonstrate, we being Ed and I, you're going to smile on that right, Ed, <laughs> the uh, posterior recovery test. So we're working on this for a new measure to help with posture and recovery of a posterior loss of balance. Uh, okay, Ed, I'm going to hold the pillow and uh, let's see if you can make it up from this distance. Just not quite. Try it again. Okay, good. Now, Ed would stop right here. We would measure the distance between his heels and the, uh, the wall itself, and we would say he was able to make it up from that height. Ed, go ahead and lean back up there against. The, so the criterion for the test uh, would be that the individual would be able to make it up uh, in one attempt without using their hands. They can use some momentum, they can use whatever technique they want. Uh, for Ed's case right now, I'm making a small exception today because I am putting the pillow back here behind him just for comfort. So normally you'd want to do this from a firm surface uh, because that obviously introduces some spacing as well. Ed, should we give it one more shot? Okay. All right, let's see what you got. Great, and he was able to fully make it up. That's the posterior recovery test. We're working on it here at NWRA and hope you enjoy.